Welcome to another episode of Nick Moody is painting the old factory. Uh, yeah, it's freaking warm today compared to the last few days. 15 degrees almost. Uh, supposed to be raining. Nonetheless, I'm going painting because I haven't been painting this year so far. Uh, and it's already March, so shame on me for that. But uh, I'm really stoked. I want to go out, I want to do something. I've got a little bit of an idea of what I want to paint today um, but mainly I just want to get the juices flowing I would just want to I just want to paint I just want to paint make a video take you guys along with me and see what the day brings so right now I'm on my way to the old factory um, as per usual and even though it's sunny right now and nice out and I want to paint outside I probably shouldn't because it's supposed to rain very soon I don't know if that's gonna happen but it looks pretty cloudy over here so it's probably my best bet to find a nice wall inside and paint there so I'll get back to you once I get there today I should probably just paint inside even though even though I would love I'd love to be outside it's so nice and warm out but it's also so windy and rainy ha huh. and down here would be an option but it's fairly dark you will remember that guy that was the last piece I painted here uh, last year in November, I want to say. That's the one I did a year ago together with Smo. Um, hoping to be painting together again soon here at the factory or wherever, actually. Okay, let's turn around and let's go inside and see if we can find a wall there. Okay, I think I'm gonna bring this box first and then we gonna have a look around first. Hmm, 
That wall looks kind of interesting. So sorry, Smo, I might have to cover up your throwy here. Yeah, let's do this one. So this seems like a reasonable wall for what I want to paint today. I'm going to go to the car, get the rest of the stuff and start priming the wall because I want to have a orange background here. Yeah, I think that's nice. I'm hoping the bricks are kind of straight, otherwise this will look weird. Okay, let's see if I can do it like this. How's that? I do nothing that straight, dude. I do not think that's straight. I would say maybe like this. Oh, that's really eyeballing it now. That's better. I think. Let's at least hope the bricks are straight horizontally. I would really appreciate that. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna let this dry. I hope it dries because it's not super warm in here. Uh, yeah, I'm an idiot. I forgot to bring a garbage bag to put this in. So that's probably something, probably something right here to pack this in. That should be enough. There you go. Okay, so as always, this is the first step, making a doodle grid and then projecting my reference photo or reference artwork onto the wall. So I brought this light, I'm gonna turn this on and hope that it 
helps with the ever-changing light condition in here. Okay, I tried, but this is not gonna get dry anytime soon, so... Yeah, I just decided to go home for the day and continue tomorrow. Okay, day two, uh, new attempt. It's pissing down, but it's not cold, so... Uh, I'm hoping the paint dried yesterday and I can start I can start actually spray painting on it today, so uh, I'm gonna go to the factory now and hope for the best That's what I wanted. Heck yeah. Nice. Pretty, pretty nasty out. Not gonna lie. Check that out. I really have to say I'm looking forward to the day when I can paint something like this or even bigger without using a doodle grid because this is really, I don't know, it would be so nice to just freehand this stuff like other artists do, like Kipto for example. Okay, I was gonna keep it real simple here, but I think I just have to add a few more elements and something in the background. I just, I can't resist. It just had to be done.
So I'm at this point where I have to decide whether I'm done with the piece or if I should keep going. I feel like I'm getting to a point where I can say, yo, this is good enough. I'm just gonna leave it as is. To me, it's really, really difficult to decide uh, to find an end. And that's something I'm working on and I think I'm getting better at it. Anyways, I think I'm done. Um, thank you guys for sticking around and watching my videos. It's really cool. I see my channel is growing and it's still super crazy to me that there's actually people watching these videos and yeah, care about what I do. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. It's still crazy to me that there's already over 2,000 people subscribed to my channel. I mean, 2,000 of you, that's super crazy. So, thanks for watching. I hope you stick around for whatever is to come next. Thanks for watching. I see you in the next video. Peace.